hello hello so I'm gonna talk really fast to get this through um, I'm gonna show you the best and easiest way and the safest method to use fast flags but before any of that you can skip this part but it's really important some people have been getting um, warnings and stuff about they're gonna get banned if they do this again using a modified version of Roblox this user was using frost trap and these users also got the same warning and they were using block strap not frost trap this one is frost trap over here, OPPO servers using uh, external fast flags such as voice trap are considered exploits. So voice trap is an exploit, yes, 100%. But it is, it's also a virus and all. But there is a weird thing when you're using block trap or something, it counts as a modified Roblox, which is really weird. It didn't happen to me, but a lot of people have said it happened to them. Watch my last video before this video. Anyways, let's get through this. How to use fast flags, the safest method. You want to go to your normal Roblox over here. I have the normal Roblox. You want to right click, you want to go to open file location, you want to type this. How do you do that? You want to right click on a blank space, go to new, go to folder. You want to type exactly like this, client settings, exactly like that. I already created one, so I'm just going to delete that. You want to enter the thing that you made. What you want to do over here is um, the client setting, exactly when I type that. You want to right click on a blank space, go to new, go to text, document. The thing about this, this might not show on your screen, right? How do you show that, right? You wanna right click on view, uh, left click, holy, what am I talking about? The windows, stop being so bad. You wanna uh, go to show, you wanna go to file name extension. See how it disappeared? You wanna make sure, make sure you turn that on or else it wouldn't work. You wanna go right click and then you wanna rename it exactly like this, client app settings dot json you want to type exactly like that right after you type all of that you want to enter you want to put your fast flags this is the fast flags i'm going to use um and then you want to control s to save you want to leave it you want to right click on it you want to go to properties by alt enter or just right click on it read only apply to make sure it doesn't update randomly or things like that um, but if you want an easier version and you have your own fast flags already ready like maybe you use block trap or frost trap so I use frost trap right I'm gonna right click on frost trap I'm getting open file location go to versions go to versions again client settings and take whatever is here I had fast flags I just put it on the Roblox let's go to block shop if you have block shop just open file location versions find the version and then you want to take your fast flags and put them on the other side where the hell was it over here just take them and put them there it'll already be set also make sure to be updated with my um, updates and announcements because I do not just put anything random I put the best things there is if you have any problems with your fast flags not working do type in the support channel that i have on the discord server thank you very much for watching make sure to subscribe as i'm not getting any money for my videos i really appreciate you for watching make sure to subscribe and thank you bye